Today on Fab Four, I'm talking about hydrating masks, and I think there's room for them in every woman's routine. A hydrating mask to me normally is a wet mask, and it comes in a tube, and it delivers that lovely layer of sort of plumpness and hydration, and it's the kind of mask to me that you remove. Now, these four babies I have used for a long time, and I've got a little fifth because I always sneak one in. But I'm going to start off with really great, does what it says on the tin, and it's number seven's Beautiful Skin. Now, I've used this for years. They've made the spiral kind of nicer now. They've changed it a little bit so that it, you get two different products out. So you see when it goes comes out, there's a gel thing and a cream coming together. So I'm just going to put that one on my forehead. The smell is the classic number seven smell and you just leave it on for 10 minutes. You don't rinse it off. I wipe this off and I leave the hydration level that's left on my skin and it feels good. And that is 10 pounds. Brilliant. It's like take it out when you're feeling a bit flat. Your skin feels it wants plumpness as opposed to glow. No specific ingredient stands out. I just know whenever I use it, my skin feels really lovely afterwards. The next one is from one of my favorite facialists. It's Jane Shrivener. There she is. And this is a de-stress mask. So it's got in it fatty acids, omegas, carotin, vitamins, softens and exfoliates. And I put this on and I actually put it on and just take off the excess as well. I don't wash it off. I don't feel meant to wash it off. I didn't even look on the tin, but um, that's what I do. And the smell, like all of Jane Shrivener's products, is unbelievable. It's just kind of floral with a hint of something a bit medicinal and herby in it. It's not gloopy gloopy, it's just a nice texture. And what I find is after about 10 minutes, it's really absorbed and I have not that much left. I put a, a lot on right now. Now, this is a mask that I've used the longest and it's, oh, by the way, Jane Trevenant is 29 pounds. This mask, I've used this probably for, I mean, God, could I say 25 years? And it has this smell that's so nostalgic. And I know that in it, there's camphor because I remember this one. And I used it when I had spots. It's for a dry skin. It's called Mask Essential. But the smell reminds me of the Eve Lom Rescue Mask. Another mask, actually, I would slip in here if you have spots. But it's not a hydrating mask, so I'm not slipping it in. Um, but I think that the Renegino one... I remember when my skin was a bit spotty, but you know when you're spotty and you need hydration? I would use this, and this definitely is a wash off with a flannel mask because it will not go in. It's just using its essential oils to kind of stimulate and hydrate the skin, and then you take it off. Next up, Biologique Recharge. Recharge or Recharge? This is the VIP mask. I love all of them, but this one is a sort of oxygenating mask and they never disclose what that oxygenation is, um, but it has in it marine elastin and white clay. And I don't know if I've even got any of this left to get it out for you. I'm really at the end, oh, there we are, there, at the end. I'll just put that here, there. And it smells clayish actually, but the price point is a hundred pounds, which is kind of insane. This has lasted me a year. But I really probably notice, I notice it more than the number seven and, and more than the um, the Shrivener. I really, really notice the difference on my skin. I hate to say you get what you pay for because I think number seven is a great product. So those all are my favorites. There's one though I can't not mention and it is the criminally insane category as if the last one wasn't. But it's the Sizzly, Sizzly Black Rose and this one, I put on at the end of aeroplane journeys. I'm gonna put a tiny bit on my hand to show you, it's so precious. But the thing about the Black Rose range, they have the cream and they have a mask. And it's just the most incredibly potent um, smell. It's like that really, you know the, the rose that isn't fresh, it's intense, it's that kind of smell. It's got algae in it, it's got vitamins in it, it's skin plumping, and I'll put that on and this one, like the Jane Shrivener, when I, after 10 minutes, there's not that much left and I will just remove the excess. But these are four slash five fabulous masks that I have used for many, many years and I rate highly.